Hi y'all, so I'm home and I keep running into all these little problems. As you guys can see, my Christmas tree is behind me. Also, welcome to another episode of Vlogmas or what is supposed to be me trying to do Vlogmas, okay? You guys saw me put up my Christmas tree and like decorate the kitchen and stuff like that. But I, I keep, I, I, oh, I keep running into all these issues. Um, my, my, this morning, right? Every time we use the plug-in kettle and like the microwave at the same time, because this morning I wanted to bake some sweet potatoes, right? When I was going to work, because I didn't meal prep yesterday, but I had some ackee and sawfish and I wanted to just bake some sweet potatoes to take to work with that can selfish for my own. So I was baking some sweet potatoes real quick and I was using the microwave. It's a plug-in kettle at the same time and when I tell you that the power in the microwave and let me put y'all up here. I'm wearing clothes they're gonna look like I'm naked. The power, damn, the power in the microwave and in the stove just completely went off and I'm like, wait the hell, a minute, what is going on? So it looked like it like chipped the breaker or whatever. I went to work and I came home and at 4 o'clock I saw that it was still out so I had to text my landlord on some hey bro, this shit is not lighting up. Do you think it might be a breaker issue? And he was like, yeah sure, I'll fix it. Five seconds and the shit was on. However, this morning when this was happening, it was 5 a.m. It's 6 p.m. right now, so 12 hours ago. So imagine what that was like. So right now I gotta be setting the time on the clock because I use it in the morning and God knows that it's off right now. 6.06 and I need to set it on here too. Okay, so that's great. Now that we've fixed that, I'm trying to see if I want to bake. Maybe I should bake the sweet potato right now. It's already in the saran wrap and I have a uh, sweet potato sitting on my microwave. So I do potato. I typically do two because I like when the potato is not two. Maybe I'll do one because it's like a small potato and it's giving it five minutes. So I'm baking the sweet potatoes so I can like finish up some meal prep. I'm not going to eat anything this evening because when I was coming from work just now, we ended up stopping and we bought um, some Italian sausage sandwich or whatever. So that was good and that was very filling because it was on like Italian bread and stuff. Bread was really good but I didn't eat all of it because it was kind of dry. But right now I'm just literally here. I'm trying to see if I can schedule my developmental psychology exam. But when I went on the website, it was, there was something else on there other than developmental psychology. I think it was human growth and something. So I had to text my friend to see if it's the same one that we're doing and then go schedule it. I think I might just schedule it next week and just be done and schedule my other class for next week. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I'm going to have to do sociology again. I'm going to do sociology. Oh, do I want to do it with another one? Probably not. I want to just do them one by one, so I'm going to schedule my next class for like the following week, right? So I can make sure that I'm doing that. And then, um, the lady said, I need to see how I go about taking the, go about taking the exam again without actually paying for it. So I need to, um, plan. So she said do sociology again. So I need to register for this Thursday. What am I doing it now? Wednesday. Oh, I like this lady. No, Wednesday at 10 a.m. Typically off on Wednesdays for the next four weeks. I'm gonna be off on Wednesdays, 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Let me check my schedule really quickly. Wednesday, absolutely see that. <laughs> you guys, I'm really literally struggling here. I literally want to make sure that I do it when I when I have time. I'll do it in the evenings. Fuck it. But I like this lady though. I'd like to um, schedule sociology with her because I I like how she teches. So I'd love to do it with her because that first man. I do not like how he teaches at all. I do not want him. He's who I had and I just don't want him. I need to figure it out. So I need to figure out, I need to schedule this other class. My potatoes baking. I just wanted to pop in and say, hi, I'm having a chill evening. I should probably drink some wine. Yesterday I ran through like two wine that I had. I need to buy some more Stella Rosa because I literally love that wine. Let me ask her, this girl to remind me. Remind me tomorrow at 3.30 p.m. to stop by the liquor store and buy some Stella Rosa Black. So I have that set up for tomorrow. That means that if I'm going to be entertaining the next couple of weeks, I could serve Stella Rosa because it's literally such a good wine. I also have another one that I could, I have a few options to be completely honest that I could serve, but lately I like having options because I just have a few on my little wine rack. I'm going to show you guys. Just a few. And this is um to make like the honey colada that I was making. Pinot Grigio, pretty, pretty good, but everybody's not going to like that. Ciroc, this is pretty good. This too. Prosecco is really good and this is like a Merlot. That's 
nice too. But you know, not everybody likes the same thing. So I want to at least have some options and stuff. So I'm going to sit and see if I can figure out scheduling a class that I want to do with this lady and like see how that works. Anyways, I'm going to go. Literally just coming from outside and it's literally so cold. Like I'm supposed to be going to the gym and like doing my best or whatever. But I can't lie, I literally cannot be in nobody's gym with it being so cold. Walking from on the block to come here has just blown me so much. Like I'm so tired. I ended up stopping in a store that recently opened to see if I could find any, um, no, I can't remember them being so small for me, $25. No, this shit is a rip off. I really didn't wear that small. Oh, they smell so much better though. But they are that small. I bought this one off of Amazon. I think I spoke about it before. And it doesn't smell like it's from Bath and Body Works, nor does it, um, the container is like plastic. Let me see if the cover says White Barn. This one is whipped coffee, and I shit you not, it literally smells like coffee. Whipped coffee. It does say White Barn, but I don't know what this is. So I bought four candles because they were having a sale where you buy one, you get one for free. Of course, one was priced at $25.99. I swear to God, these were bigger than this. This is my all-time favorite, um, one. Outside of like the vanilla or whatever, Mahogany Teakwood Intense is my literal favorite because it just smells like a man. This was for $25.50. So I bought two for pretty much $50 and I literally got two for free. And the other day I was bugging out because they had a sale that I missed. I'm like, oh my gosh, like, could I miss this sale? I put the things in my cart and the next day they were literally gone. But so far I have these four. This is a new one that I'm trying. This is iced vanilla wood. I really hope it smells good. Oh, that's nice. The containers are gloss. That one I don't know. Somebody on Amazon sent me. I bought one of the same thing. Let's see. You know, maybe no one scammed me. Maybe it's literally the same thing. I don't know how I feel. Anyways, this is warm vanilla sugar. But I think I'm gonna burn iced vanilla wood. What that smells like. I feel like that one that I bought from Amazon isn't really giving, like you don't really smell it as much and if that's how these ones are, then I'm better off going back to Marshalls and buying the ones that they have out there. But I always get like a better burn, honestly, when I buy them from. So I'm gonna like these too. Like it already smells good. Probably bugging because I'm upset about the other one. So I have these two going, hopefully in here starts smelling really good really quickly. I swear to God, I remember them being bigger. That means the candle, the, the candles at Marshalls are bigger for my money because they're way bigger than these. Always trim wicks a fourth of an inch before burning again. I really should have burned whipped coffee. If that one smells good, I'll put whipped coffee in the kitchen. It smells really good. I'm gonna tear this box up because honestly, I don't feel like going back outside. together spent how much? 6205. I'm gonna lay down in this bed, listen to my lecture, and then shower up, lay down, find something to eat.